Hey everybody, it's Party Elite. Welcome you back to another episode of our Total War Three Kingdoms Records Mode Let's Play as the Kingdom of Chi. This should be a solid episode for us, a solid session, as I think we will finally finish off Gongsun Zen. I do believe it's possible to do it this session, and that's exactly what we're going to try and do. But of course, distractions might come in the, uh, you know, in the west over here, or even to the south over here. And if we get drawn into too many battles, then it might slow down our progress. But yes, as many of you caught the pun, uh, Gongsun Zen will soon be gone soon, Zen. And you know what? I think that works well enough. <laughs> gone soon, Zan, indeed. Uh, we'll, we'll try and push. We'll try and finish it off. And it shouldn't be a problem. We've got one small city over here that we're already on top of. Uh, we've got another small city over here we'll get on top of, I believe, next turn we can get to. Uh, and then all this is an iron mine, trade port, tool maker, and another city all the way back here. So should be relatively smooth and quick battles. Like these should be like two minute battles at most. We've got trebuchet and stuff on, on in, in all these armies. So. I don't think it'll be that much of a problem. Uh, however, of course, we might get distracted down over here. We did send Deng Jiang out over here to try and protect the deserted town of Hedong. Not so much to prevent its capture, because chances are Lubu is going to move in there and capture it. However, it's more so to prevent its long-term capture, I guess. Uh, if they do manage to take the, uh, the city back, uh, I want to strip it right away. I want to take it back right away because I don't want Lubu to have... Sort of a forward operating base where he can replenish all these troops. So we need to prevent uh, the long-term ownership of this area uh, just to force Lubu back a little bit. Uh, apart from that, up over here as well, a little nervous about Huang Bing making a move towards the toolmaker at Taiyuan. I don't know if uh, Ma Dai is close enough, but it's the best we could do. Even if we lose the toolmaker, it's fine. We'll roll in right afterwards and take it back. So not going to spend any time or money upgrading the toolmaker now, though I do need to consider that as, as something worth doing. Also, maybe upgrading this iron mine is maybe not a bad idea. That's maybe not a bad idea at all, actually. Anyway, we'll look at that in a bit because there's some other stuff that needs dealing with. Uh, down south over here, uh, Lu Su is all the way up there right now. He just took the toolmaker at Xiangyang. Uh, you know, so good for him. Made some moves against, uh, oh, what was her name? Gong Lan Shu. They have one last piece of territory up over here, the trade port at Luoyang. But they also have this little farmland at Yangzhou. I don't know how I missed it. Good point in the comments. And again, thank you very much for pointing it out. I don't know how, I guess I got so used to seeing their name as uh, the Kingdom of Shuhan or something. So I didn't notice that there was a little piece left. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, but I missed it. And it's okay. We're going to get it soon enough. Uh, however, Lu Su might need to move all the way down over here to rescue Ling Ling. Because while the rebellion force is probably not enough to cause me any panic, and we do have a decent garrison, my... Hold on a second. Oh man, I never repaired any of this stuff. I should repair all this stuff. I right, repair all this stuff first. Um, okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Here is what we're gonna do. We've got something of a garrison over here. I don't know how I feel about that upgrade. Actually, we lose the cavalry and replace them with swords. However, we get another building slot, and I could use that additional building slot to build the um. Where is it? The patrols, which add some cavalry and some saber militia. Or, I could swap swap one of these out and get it done sooner, right? Because I just need a level 4 structure for this. A level 4 settlement, I believe. But that's maybe not a bad idea, actually. This gives us what? Pop growth. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and demolish you. This actually worked out. Okay, instantly do that. Go ahead and add to our garrison, instantly construct that, right? They'll take some time to, uh, to muster, but I think this garrison should be able to take on this army. They might recruit another retinue, which might make it a bit of a problem. Let's see, what kind of... Really start looking at some bigger upgrades over here. We've got a lot of money. Let's do that. Now, which way here? Public order... And enemy reserve reduction? Hmm. I guess that's all that stacks up over here. Yeah. Oh, plus one starting rank for cavalry recruits. The White Horse Fellows raiding parties. 
I mean, that feels, like, worth chasing after, I guess. Not that I'll be recruiting much cavalry down here, I don't think. But, sure, it's something unique. Go ahead and construct you. Rush you out. Beautiful. So now, over here, we have a decent... ...size garrison. This is all just a bunch of peasants and stuff. Yeah, we should be able to hold. Okay, let's go ahead and repair these. Sorry. Wasn't sure how I wanted to solve this problem. Initially, I was thinking of sending Lu Su down south again. Just because, again, the last time we had a rebellion attack Ling Ling, uh, they were big enough to actually force a defeat, which was making me nervous at the time. So, this solution maybe will work out instead, as long as they don't besiege us right away. Cool. And then up over here, meanwhile, we're sending this army up into Tsaren, while this army is going south into Tsaren. Tsaren? Tsaren? Okay, I keep butchering it. Uh, but we're going to finish these guys off. Pretty quickly, I think. Unfortunately, our economy has taken a hit from the reduction in, well, a little bit of reduction in trade and a lot more army upkeep costs and stuff. Sunren's army has grown very big. And on top of Sunren's army, uh, someone mentioned in the comments that uh, this guy looks like he might be a spy, but I have no reason to believe that they are a spy. Um, I think we're okay. Hopefully. They don't hate us or anything. I'm not going to give them... Like, they're not, uh, you know, particularly prone to disloyalty. They are a bandit. Hopefully not from the other bandit, uh, but uh, I, I think I'm willing to take this risk for now. I think I'm okay with this. He doesn't like Shi Yi. He does like Sun Ren, and Shi Yi doesn't doesn't like Zhou Jinqing. So I think I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be fine. Anyway, enough talk. I think it's time for action. Uh, what we're going to do is over here. We're going to use our spy. He's finally got enough cover, I believe, to yes poison the provisions. Right? So that's what we're going to do. We're going to try and cause some damage to this army. Uh, you know, come hell or high water, we'll try and reduce this army so that when we actually attack, we're not going to do a night battle. And again, in the comments, there was a little bit of conversation about this. We're not going to do a night battle. We're actually going to do a proper, normal battle, daytime battle, allow the reinforcements to come so we can destroy that army, hopefully. And then Sun Ren will have a safer approach towards Yu Bei Ping. And then next turn, she can maybe try and take that city. Hopefully. That's my thinking right now. This guy does have fire arrows, and I forget, let me just double check over here, we have fire arrows as well. No flaming shots, though, fortunately, but hopefully we'll be there soon. Wow, long way to go. Anyway, that's the plan. As I do this, folks, just want to mention really quickly, as always, if you've been enjoying this series and you would like to see it continue, don't hesitate to let me know. Drop a like and a comment down below, and more so than just this one continuing, if you want to see more Total War Three Kingdoms on the channel, which is what it sounds like, uh, the best thing you can do is, again, leave those likes and comments. Just gives me an understanding of what I should do more or less of, and many of you want to see uh, uh, Ma Tang next. Uh, and that's seeming like the most popular choice, but I will throw a vote up closer to the end of this campaign. It'll also be in our Discord, so if you're not in our Discord, check the link to that out in the description of the video down below. Um, the, the Discord's great. It's got over 2,000 people, all sorts of, you know, gaming fans, a great community. I'm very proud of it, uh, and I, I do interact there and, and get, you know, people's temperatures, so to speak, uh, there a lot. So if you, you know, if you want to have a bit of a say as to, like, what happens next, I'll throw a vote up on the last video of this campaign, but also in that Discord, there'll probably be a conversation. Anyway, I'm getting myself distracted by myself. Let's go ahead and poison military provisions. Uh, yep, your own armies, not, uh, not Italian, your own armies. And confirm that. Okay. Something in the water. Under cover of darkness, your spy's agent sets about lacing the army's fresh water supplies, but is startled by members of the Night Watch. They demand answers. Your undercover network has other members present within the army. With a word, they can see to it that the meddlers are added to this night's casualties. Mm okay. So I could cancel, but I... Because so the thing is, I don't have enough cover to commit unfortunately. And maybe I pulled the trigger prematurely, but I felt like I had to just to weaken this army a little bit. So we're going to go ahead and commit, and whatever comes of it, comes of it. Tu Ying, you did well. If this is where you die, then this is where you die. <laughs> let's uh, let's commit. Oh, it feels bad, because I know it's not going to go well. But maybe it'll go well enough, you know what I mean? All right, one of our spies has been discovered and captured. Their mission may have been successfully completed already, but we've nevertheless lost a valuable agent to the enemy. Hopefully they haven't been killed. They're, they might still be released. Anything could happen. Yeah, okay, one of our spies has been captured. Mission to arrange for the poisoning of an army's provision was successful, but they failed to cover their implication in the deed. Right. So, hopefully, this army... Okay. The retinue didn't 
disappear, but at least that's one less general to deal with. Did we cause any damage here? Can't remember the numbers before. Well, you know what? I'm happy enough with what happened. Not actually. I was hoping for more damage output, if there even was any. But I'll take it. In we go. Uh, it'll be a regular battle, close defeat the game predicts, but I don't think that's likely. The reinforcements will probably take some time to arrive. Uh, by the time they do arrive, or maybe even... Maybe we take care of the reinforcements before we enter the city. It'd be pretty funny if we could... Take the city... And then defend it against the reinforcements? That would be interesting. Alright, well, you know what? Let's dive on in, and uh, let's see what we can do. Alright... Let's see what we can do. Reinforcements are coming from over there. This town, I mean, pretty well defended. They've got a lot of... T oh, wow, holy crap, that's a lot of towers back there. Uh, over here, not so many. This is feeling like the right spot to come in through then. They've got uh, stairs back over here that we can get access to uh, the main area. Uh, the reinforcements are going to come from there and head this way, probably try to enter the city. If we can get into the city before them, if we can get onto the walls and and have control of these towers before they arrive, that would be amazing. Imagine that, okay. I mean, okay, I might wanna try that, actually. We, we just have to use our spears a little bit more aggressively than we've done before. And if we can push through and, they do have some barricades set up over here, but if we could push through and capture a bunch of these towers. Almost makes you want to go through here. That's a big risk. There's a lot of towers. But if our archers can take care of any of the spears they have, it could be amazing for us. You know what, guys? Let's let's try it. Let's try it. But what wall section must I destroy? Or what 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 uh, towers and wall section must I destroy? It does look like this is also the least. Guarded? Oh no, those towers over there will cause us some trouble. Okay. Okay. So we could do... This area over here. We have to get rid of one, two, three, four. Right, we get rid of these four. And then we should be able to push through here. And try to take these towers with our spears. I like the sound of that. And then we can defend the newly captured town from the incoming attackers. <laughs> Defenders, whatever. Okay, this should be fun. This should be fun. Let's let's try it out, folks. Try something a little, little different. We do have flaming arrows, so we could actually... You know what I learned was... These guys are totally worth poking and prodding with. Let's go ahead and... Oh, there's obstructions back here. That's a little annoying. Okay, let's put... Uh, you over here. And two of you over here. Damn, like, obstruction back over here is being a pain. What I'll do is send these guys up to uh, light this up. And send these guys up to maybe light this up or light that up or both. And uh, that should be good for us as well. Let's make sure we get all this set up right. Okay, there you go. Get you up over here. Spears are ready. Swords, well, let's get... You guys set up over here. No, well, very little cavalry in this army, unfortunately. Let's keep you up over here, hidden, I guess, for now. We'll send them charging through later. Okay, I uh, this is going to be a very different kind of siege battle than what I've usually done, but it should be a good one. Uh, swords and, and whatnot, I'm getting prepared for these guys to maybe push around this way and chase after us. Uh, so I want to keep the swords and, and uh, axes back over here. As well as the cav, as the spears go through and take the city. Okay, that's gonna be interesting. Put it that way. It's gonna be interesting. Let's uh, let's begin. Go over here. Take you out over here. Send you up to set these guys up a light. Send you up there. Okay, we just got to be quick on these guys. So a little less cinematic uh, angles. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. What are you doing? Why are you rotating this weird way? You need to move a lot faster than that. The walls are taking damage, it's good. Okay, we're firing. You just gotta be quick about this. Come on, come on, come on. Gotta get it above 50. 
happen pretty soon. Okay, there it is. Fire over there as well. Over here. Wow. Ball section already down. Going good, going good. Get it up to that 50. Excellent. Fire over here next. Fully back. Let's go. Fall back, fall back, fall back. Alright. You're on fire. You're on fire. You're about to be on fire, hopefully. Oh, it is on fire. Let's pull back. Alright. Get you firing over here. Get you firing over here, maybe. These guys are pulling back. Our towers are going down. Towers are all going down. I don't like those archers up there. How are we doing? Hey, good hits up there. Nice. Walls down. What about back here? Need to get rid of the uh, spears mainly because I want to be able to push through without getting caught up in melee. That's my main concern. Now, these towers are all going down thanks to the fires. Beautiful. Go ahead and send you up. Whoa. Towers fall. Beautiful. Turtled up. Excellent. Can you both try and hit these guys, please? Try and scare them off a little bit. The other option is, of course, to try and take out more uh, wall sections and scare some of the archers away. Probably we're going to get some good hits here. Alright, spears are marching through. I'm excited for this battle because it's a little different than the uh, sieges we fought lately. I'm excited for it. Very excited for it. I wonder if we can't... Ooh, we should just group up a little bit and 2v1 these archers. Right. Okay, shots continue to come through from the artillery. Continue to do a fair bit of damage. Yeah, is it looking the wrong way? Beautiful. The reinforcements have not... I mean, they've probably arrived inside the city at this rate. I don't know how I feel about this situation, if I'm completely honest. Okay. Get you firing. Hold your fire. Push you through. Let's go. Another turtle formation. Let's get in here first. Go as quickly as possible, and then we'll turtle up again. You have uh, the spears over there moving in. Once we get within range... Oh, that tower is still up. What the hell? <laughs> I ignored that tower. Foolish me. Foolish me. Pull these archers back. Be satellites soon enough. We should be able to pull you back now. Yep. Okay, we're back in turtle formation. I'm gonna move you all the way up there. I'm gonna move you all the way up here. Capture this set. I'm gonna move you all the way up here. Go. Oh. Okay, okay, good stuff, good stuff. back a little bit. Oh no, I set this on fire. I didn't need to. <laughs> uh, here's what we're going to do. We're going to set you up over here. And we're going to send you up over here. Here are those archers. All right, let's get ready for this. Start capturing some of these towers. The towers will help us. Okay. Stuff, good stuff. Reinforcements are actually still all the way back there, and they're going to be really tired when they get here. Okay, captured. You're moving over here. Ooh. Leaves an opening for our archers to move up. And for our cavalry to move up as well. Get you guys up over here. Get you guys up over here. Let's go. Artillery, you're able to fire up over there. Let's do it.
stuff. Capturing up over here. Well, let's send you up over here, and let's send you up over here. Let's get you up over here as well. Oh, prepare for that charge. Alt. Okay. And you up over here. Hopefully we'll finish capturing this quickly enough. Good stuff. Spears, let's get you... Excuse me. They turtled up, please. Moving up, moving up. Archers. And fire over here. Focus and get rid of those archers. Regular shots. Holding over there. Those towers are maybe causing us some trouble, but we're going to loop around and get there. Artillery is firing away. I don't know if it's getting any work done. I think I had to move up a little bit, maybe. Better cavalry up in here. Oh. Go up here, maybe. Actually, let's go up here. Go, we're firing away. Are you guys... How are you engaged in melee? Who are you engaged in melee with? Pull you back a little bit. Holding here, taking this tower. May move in and support. Or actually, let's stay, stay over here. This tower is soon to be ours. Come on. Come on. We've lost a tower. Ow. <laughs> There's no tower there to lose. Alright, we've got you. Let's move you up this way. Archers are firing away. Fortunately, safe back there. A little bit of fire here to scare them off. There come their reinforcements. How are we doing over here? Doing okay. Move you guys up a little bit. Get you guys moving up as well. Let's run you in. Maybe we can capture some of these... Uh, Powers on the side over here. They're going to be able to get through the gate, unfortunately. Okay, and we go with some charges. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Wait, why are you... Oh, you got to go up there. Oh, not good. Not exactly what I had in mind. Go. Alright, we're coming through here. Good stuff. You guys have done your job. Let's go ahead and pull you up this way. Let's go. And I could get them onto the... The walls use that for transport instead. Alright, we're giving chase over here still. Don't mind that. Trying to hold up there. Sending you up. Oh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. The archers are almost out of ammo. I think I need to dive in over here. Get some extra support in. Get you guys over here. Keep you chasing. Alright. What about this reinforcing army... Like, not dying? Get you up over here. Get you guys... Actually, are you able to come up over here? I think so. Let's do that. Go, let's go. You guys have given up. Excellent. Now, one of these units is actually taking a lot of damage. Taking a lot of hurt. Get you up here. They're pouring through. What are you trying to do? What are you trying to do? What are we trying to do over here? Go up here. Cavalry is coming through. Yeah. Gotta try and capture this. Av is up here. We're going to try to capture that. Up we go. Come on, hurry it up, hurry it up. No time to waste. I want to try and destroy these units. Alright. Going to be ours soon. Go. Go. Ah, they're coming through. Get ready up over here. Send you in with a rear charge. And you in with a rear charge as well. Let's go. Get 
up here, get up here. Probably too late to capture these towers. And by too late, I mean pointless. Pull back. The cav is coming through. Your charge was semi-successful. Let's pull you back a little bit. You over. Let's go. Giving up back over here. Yeah, let's pull you back down. We capture those towers. Rear charge. Pull you back. Come on. Av is arriving. You back again. Get you in for a rear charge next. Get these guys to break, please. Go. Charge over there. Decent charge, looks like. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Very good charge. Spears ready up over here and up over here. Pull you back this way. Pull you out. Pull you up that way. All right. Yeah, we're going to take some losses, but. Oh, what are you going to do about it? And fire up over here. Fire up over there. Let's get you in from behind. Let's go. Get up over here. It's gonna be a tough fight. Keep pushing, keep pushing. The wall over here. The wall over there, okay. Axes are arriving. The wall. Excellent. What are we doing over here? Doing okay, our spears are engaged. Let's go. Let's pull you up over here. Pull you up over here as well. Come on. Go. And the spear's in. Oh, let's go, let's go. Get you firing up over here. Maybe scare something off over here, maybe if we're fortunate. Send you down this way, send you through this way, let's go. Like, really not the ideal spot to be fighting. <laughs> send you up over here. Be back. And he's fleeing over here, excellent. Regular shots. Get you down there. Try and get a charge before they're able to brace or anything. Pull you back up. Oh, no, they're bracing. Pull back. How are we doing down over here? Okay-ish. Want charge? Find that gap. Find that gap. That's all I need. Arrows are coming through over here, helping out. Spears are doing well over here. Pull back, pull back, pull back. Wall you back. Okay, good. Get in here. You guys are going to start giving up soon as well. No, why are you... Are over here, damn it. Battle's almost over. Battle is almost over. They're braced over... Oh, no, they're not anymore. Try it. Got my finger on the backspace in case I gotta stop it. There we go. <laughs> Stopped it just in time. Their general seems to be running now. Eating another charge there. Push in. Go. There we go. Excellent. Punch right through that unit. Beautiful. Good damage down there. Let's push through. You guys are giving up. Alright. Bring you around this way. Let's go. Pull you through this way. Let's go. Let's go. Those spears have taken a massive beating. We need to replenish after this battle for sure. Pull you back. Take a bad hit there. Get these spears up over here. Keep the uh, axe band engaged against the swords. Get these spears out of there. Good charge over here. Any more units to charge into down over here? 
The cab is getting away, unfortunately. These guys are going to get away as well. Try giving chase. Victory is ours. All right, wonderful. That's not good enough right now. Not good enough. I need to... Well, I mean, I don't want to get shot at by these towers on my way out. <laughs> Let's just keep firing over here. Keep you up here. It's okay. We'll, we'll cause what damage we can on these guys' ways out. You might get away. Make sure you don't. Make sure you don't. Okay, that was an interesting battle. That was an interesting battle that uh, went about as planned, I would say. About. Managed to get the towers, managed to uh, creep through, managed to cause a fair bit of damage. I'd say I'm relatively happy with how that went. Oh, well, let's go over here. Clump these guys up. Bring you down over here. Let's go. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with that. If we can't finish these guys off before they get out. Probably not. Ah, they're going to get out. I don't want to get uh, sniped by one of these towers out there. But that's okay. We'll claim the victory over here, I think. A Pyrrhic victory. That's fair to say, I would say. That's fair to say. But we were, uh, we were outnumbered. We were... I mean, we were definitely outnumbered. And we were up against walls and towers and this and that and the other thing. So, pretty satisfied with how that went. Nice long battle, actually. And uh, let's see the numbers, actually. We weren't outnumbered. Really? Okay, I guess... Yeah, okay, I guess we weren't outnumbered. It was just, like, the, the walls and towers and stuff. All right. All right. And our spy... Well, he wasn't there, so he's okay. Uh, loot and Occupy, get the money, use it to... Maybe replace some of these troops? No, I don't think I should do that. I don't think I should do that. I think we should just occupy. Let's not damage the settlement. We can make it a nice uh, base for us. Occupy. There we go. I was wondering what that little slowdown was about. What's this? Okay, it's just that news. Fair enough. So it'll take two turns for these guys to get back in the action. However, we did throw these guys back a long way. Ah. <sighs> Unfortunately, not able to engage with Sun Ren. It'll take these guys two turns to recover a lot of their units. I mean, we did some damage. I don't know if we did enough, though, if I'm completely honest. I don't know if we did enough. I could rush out a little bit. There's no point, like, trying to set up an ambush or anything. There's nowhere I can get an ambush done successfully. If I can get outside of the reinforcement range of the city, though, and maybe bait an attack out. I doubt it'll happen. I think they're likely to cower behind their walls. Go ahead and push up to... About here, with Sinran. Really wish I could, like... Yeah, they're just going to creep up that way. Which is too bad, but... Fine. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, we... Could upgrade you? Nah, I don't think... Uh, I don't think I want to spend money over here right now. Pretty happy with how that went overall. Just kind of analyzing my situation right now in terms of these moves we've just made. And the damage we took in that battle. Forgetting about that one tower in the center cost me a lot of archers, I think. But they did okay, and they'll recover quickly enough. I think it'll take, what, three turns? Yeah, three turns until fully, re fully replenished. Four turns for some of these archers. But uh, that's not the end of the world. This is more of a problem. However, our forces are still stronger than theirs, and I think we'll be fine for it. All right, I do believe that's the turn. I think everyone else has moved. Let's just take a quick check over here. It's starting to get to a scale where I need to double check. Uh, we do have an assignment available, for example, so maybe I should consider that. Uh, you're just a court noble. You're not actually assigned to anything yet. Lady Wu has come back from Beihai. I could send her back out. She was, uh, I mean, she's able to do a couple of things. I'm wondering if counteracting corruption is the best thing to do. Um, let's check out who makes us the most money. Yi already has counteract corruption, if I'm not mistaken. 
No, I guess not. We could do it over here. Corruption's not as much of a problem here as it used to be. But it is still hurting us. We would reduce it to nil if we were to send her in here. Hmm. Let's see if there's somewhere else that uh, needs it more, maybe. Tangsha should be at... Oh. Tangsha needs it more. Sure. Good. I'm glad I checked. Whoa, wait, wait. Yeah, okay. So, Lady Wu. You. Counteract corruption. Here. And that should make us a ton of money. That should bounce us back real fast. Uh, Alright, I think that is the turn. We'll see what the AI does. I'm pretty sure these guys have moved. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, cool. Let's see what the AI does, uh, especially over here. A little nervous about the situation over here, but uh, time will tell how that works out. And we'll see what happens to our spy as well. Gungsun Zen is being the coward, as always, pulling back into safety. But little does he know that there is no safety to be found. Lu Bu seems to be pulling back as well. Coward. Probably a wise move. Cower before the Empress. Ooh, Huang Bing is... Oh. Hmm. Mm, okay. And Xin is moving up over here as well. What is this like the new main battleground now? We've got another Han Xin army moving in. This is not... I don't like this. This is an annoying place to defend as well. So I'm not a fan of that. Cao Ren seems to have moved in to defend. And Zhang Xi is pulling back as well. Okay. Lots of movement. Most of it I don't like. Oh, of course you're going to attack this turn. Of course. All right. Our spies preparing to return from their mission, having become a known quantity of their target. Unfortunately, even the small level of fame means they are no longer effective as a spy and so must return to normal duties. Unless circumstances change, they will soon be ready to receive new orders. Now, I don't know if they're actually a spy, if they're a counter-spy now. So I need to be very careful about Tu Ying when they arrive here. Fraternal instincts. Luxuries of silk and jade are nothing for this general compared to the love of family. Close friends and relatives are all the treasures they need to feel fulfillment, and these they maintain through simple respect and honor. If only all people were as easily content. Lu Su is satisfied. Good. War coordination target cancelled. I assume that's because you guys took it. Mm, I love it. I love when your vassals actually listen to uh, to what you need them to do. That's great. Here's some good moves. It's too bad I'd like to take more of Lu Bu's land myself, but... I'm proud of my vassal. Yan Yao is actually growing. Very proud, very proud. Uh, let's see, Han Tung is honest. Okay. And Ken Xiao Xiao is understanding. Oh, nice, extra cunning, that's very good. Understanding uh, understanding, and how to dismantle Gong Sun Zen's defenses. <laughs> that's what he's understanding. Okay, feeling pretty good. Xun Ren is able to move in and put these guys under siege. We need to remember there is an army back there. So we might have to retreat. Like, am I... The garrison is nothing. This army isn't all that big either, if I'm completely honest. I could bring these guys up to reinforce additional trebuchet. And over here, we do have flaming arrows and flaming shots. I think we actually might be able to do this right here, right now. Rather than have to wait for, you know, anything. I'm a little nervous about that army that ran away. A little nervous about it. I could send a different spy in. Sure. Look, yeah, you lost one and one just happened to show up. One just happens to show up. Go ahead and check out Lingling Ling real quick. Please tell me it was worth it. Eric victory. You know what? I'll take it. Yeah, see, they get another retinue and everything. Yeah, so Pyrrhic Victory is good enough for me. Let's go ahead and delegate that. Don't you dare be coming back. We destroyed everything except for the generals themselves. And then we lost so much too. Let's go ahead and take the replenishment. They'll be back and in greater numbers. Oh god, don't you dare actually come back in greater numbers. And we'll be in greater numbers too. Lusu might actually need to come down. In fact, you know what? You know what? My vassal has done so well against Lu Bu, I feel like Lu Su can pull down. Let's go ahead and give you a new target. Um, select the Silk Trader. I don't know if they'll be able to take on Tang'an. 
Okay. That should be good. That should be real good. Now, this is going to be a bit of a problem. Should be able to take on these armies with, uh, with Madai. This is going to be a bit of a problem as well. This is annoying. And then over here, I thought I saw... Yeah, and these guys... They don't like anybody. <laughs> Probably... Not helping. Little promotion there. Fine. More resolve and instinct is available. Give it to you. Use it. And we can go in here. The temple itself has a garrison. Yep. We do have artillery. We do have fire arrows. No flaming shots, unfortunately. We could probably still stick to that script, or... Ah, no, that's, uh... That's, that's two turns away, so they can keep bouncing back and forth. It's okay, I've got pressure coming in from down south over here as well. Um, we could just move first and then decide where to go afterwards. Two turns to get up to there. Sure. Let's flip the pie like this. We're gonna have, uh, Deng Yan taking Lang Yi and, uh, small regional city here. While... Her Yan and uh, Cao Zi will take on these three. I think that'll be a fair split. We up this way. Look, they have like three full stacks or something waiting for us. Okay, listen. Rush over. Ah, oh, patience. I don't have that kind of patience. Uh, this is okay. This is another thing I need to think about. Down over here, though, let's go ahead and push in. I, 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 I totally was off the mark when I said this is going to happen in one session. Siege battles last like 20 minutes. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. Sorry, folks. Uh, but, make it a night battle over here, just to help our cause a little bit. We could try to starve them out. They'll sally forth, but I almost want them to funnel through. Oh, it's an open field battle. Mmm. That actually does not work in my favor. That actually just does not work in my favor, I don't think. Because they'll be widespread for my artillery and archers and stuff. We don't have that much of a front line. It's going to be an interesting battle. It's going to be an interesting battle. All right, ladies and gentlemen, a lot of work to do. We got a lot of work to do today. Um, let's pull back real quick. Things we don't even have that many like generals. <laughs> Touch of cavalry. Okay, we'll set you up over here. Maybe we'll sneak up through the trees and try to get into their archers or something like that. Uh, we have... I mean... is isn't really a front line. Yeah, okay, I'm kind of... I'm kind of nervous. Not gonna lie. Guys lined up. Like so. Get you... Joining this group. In the trees. Oh, you can actually Vanguard deploy. Some of you can. You can actually Vanguard deploy all the way up over here. These guys can catch up afterwards. Fair enough. Fair enough. And our artillery placed down over here. Okay. Something like that. Archers are probably best split into two groups, if I'm completely honest. There we go. Just because when the enemy comes, they'll be coming in multiple directions. You guys are fine there. You guys will need to get a lot of work done today. Alright, it's going to be interesting. It's going to be interesting. Let's begin. If we can hold. Might have gotten a little too aggressive here. Fire away. A cab on this side. Okay, artillery, fire away, please. Get some work done over here. Can cause a fair bit of damage with some bouncing shots. Oof. I feel like we already did a little bit of damage there. <laughs> From the yells, it seemed to be the case. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fair enough. Keep it coming, keep it coming. Move you up over here. Draw the cavalry up there.
back. I'm worried about their archers firing away at my cav. We're like inches away from each other. And you up there, let's go. Have you in there? And you up there? Are we still firing away? Come on. Shots in faster. Go, 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 go. Now I've been I've been told I should commit my cavalry more often. I I I treat them like glass cannons too much, and uh, yeah, maybe I do. Maybe I do. Maybe I should commit them more. We're gonna try it here. Get our charges in and try to devastate their cavalry first. I just always fear for their archers getting work done while we're uh, damaging their cav. But it seems like our artillery is getting work done actually today. So feeling pretty good about that. Let's pull you back a little bit. And warriors run up there. Let's go ahead and fire. On over here, try to scare you off. You firing up over there. Pull you around for a charge. Go in, keep you over. Oh, no, they're running away. Okay, good stuff. You're going for a charge. Hopefully, it's a good one. As not brace, spears are coming through. Let's pull you back. Out of there, let's go. Go up over here. You chasing here. Go, let's go. Artillery is firing. We're getting some work done up there. Big clumps over there. Fire over here. Throw you up. Giving chase. Keep giving chase. We okay over there. Pull you up. Alright, we're firing over there. Let's keep pulling you back. Try and get behind our spears. Artillery is firing up there. You're Having a good time up over here. Chase after this nonsense too, please. Let's go. How are we doing over here? About to get a charge in. Turn you around. Hold these guys in place. Pulling you to our spears. Let's go. Which are all... Fire. We're going to eat a charge over here. Enemy runs. Firing up over here. Bring you back around this way. Alright, alright. Artillery. You're firing up over there. There might be better places to fire with the artillery. Good over here. We're good over here. Let's send you up this way. We want you back, actually, for some rear charges. Bring you up and around for some rear charges. Okay, we're firing up there. We're almost done over there. You guys. Turn around fire that way. You're okay. I could not. Actually, you, know, you stay there. My unit flees. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. And get some work done there. Let's pull you here for a rear charge. This isn't good. We're going to eat a charge there. Let's set you guys up for some charges as well. Hold your fire. Fire up there instead. There are trees blocking us, which is unfortunate, but is what it is. Let's pull you back. All right, in comes that rear charge up there. And set up for a charge over here. Pull you back. You're engaged. Sure, you're getting a charge up there. Beautiful. After that charge, we're going to pull you over here. You're fine over there still. These guys are giving up. Excellent. Let's push in here. Let's push in here. Let's go. Pull you up. I don't know why you're moving up that way. Get charge over here. They're going to break. Okay, excellent. Love it. Need to break, please. Send you up this way for some charges, maybe. Pull you guys back. Turn you around to fire up this way. Let's go. Ready to envelop a little bit. You're coming through still. What are we doing over here? Let's push you through. Let's go. Archers are going to bug me a little bit, but... Let's move you up this way. Yeah, these shots are doing well. Let's get a charge in there. Uh, archers fire over here. Get these archers firing over here. I'm going to pull you in over here. Come on, let's go. Go out of there. That was a bad charge. Alright, some good support coming in. Pull you back this way. Let's go. Getting ready for a rear charge up over here. Indeed you are. We're getting ready for a rear charge up over here. Go. Go, let's go, let's go. Let's bring you down this way. Come on. What's happening over here? We're good. Let's pull you back. And you in. Let's go. There we go. The rear charge over here will do a bit of work. Excellent. Fire up here. Fire up here. Pull you back. Engage with spears back there. Let's go. You had a good time. We're scaring these guys off. I love it. There we go. Looking like a costly victory. And you up here. Pushing you through. Let's push you through up here. 
All right. Strat is just getting some work done today. I shouldn't say it that like that. Strat is getting some kills today. Strategists are always getting work done. Just because they're not always killing doesn't mean they're not making some of the biggest differences on the battlefield. Go. Pull you out a little bit. Engaged over here again. Pull you back. Try and provide some assistance. Actually, let's maybe push in here for a rear charge. Finish this frontline engagement off completely. Oh, well, there it is. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Do it that way instead. Pull you back a little bit. Pull you up here. Meiji, oof. Is he about to try to restore the battlefield situation? Is he about to pull off the restoration? I don't think so, buddy. I don't think so. Here we go. Come on. I think they're all shattering any second now. They're, they might have an unbreakable general, perhaps, on the field. Maybe a couple units here and there that are not willing to give up just yet. Ah, no, there it is. <laughs> there it is. Oh, again, our victory grows ever closer. Our victory is already here. Um... Uh, City battle will just claim the victory. Close victory. That's fair. That's fair. Didn't go super smoothly, but, you know, for what we had, I feel like we did quite well. The artillery... Oh, my God. 300, 270. Woo. Baby. 329 and 199 on the strategies as well. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Uh, again, working with that sitcom joke that was put in the comments, I just imagine this, like, episode about them competing. It's almost like, uh, like Gimli and Legolas, like... <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, we destroyed these guys. Occupy it. It's a temple. You can't you can't loot a temple. Come on. Lost a lot though. Lost a third of our army there, ish. But in we go. And uh replenish we shall do. Are you really that upset? Here. Now the chief of records. Plus ten satisfaction faction wide doesn't doesn't feel like it. He does deserve a higher or position, I suppose. He also has leveled up. We'll go with uh, expertise. Sorry, with uh, precision. Because then we can get resourcefulness soon after. So that's that. These guys still haven't leveled up. Fair enough. Very cool, very cool. Happy with that push. We've taken that. We're about to take uh, Donghai. Uh, over here, Deng Jiang, what to do with you? Then this army packing. Well, hold on. Let's go in a regular stance. That's there's a quantities situation over here. Because they're 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 everywhere. <laughs> they're everywhere. And the water over here, so it'll probably take them longer. I can push up over here, force this guy back up that way. Uh while our vassal takes the Hanzong Silk Trader. And then we push up there. They might land around Hedong. I don't want to upgrade this because I don't think I can upgrade it enough to actually have a, a, a garrison that's actually worth anything. Oh, hey. Her Yan and Cao Zi have become friends. <laughs> but you know, the, the kind of friends that talk smack all the time. That kind of friend. That kind of friend. And over here as well, we're able to actually crush this army. Or this army. Or we can just hop on into the Toolmaker. Uh, I don't think I have that kind of personality on Ma Dai. This cavalry will come uh, trampling down, I think. Interesting. And then Lu Su, what do we do with you? I can... Uh, force march pretty far. We can move towards the Gonglan Shu settlement there. Yeah, let's try that. Let's do that. Our vassal is doing okay over here. Deng Dang's pushing in as well. Ma Dai is right there as well. So I'm feeling good about this. Feeling good about this. Uh, this decision is a tough one that I need to make. Do we dive on in with uh, Xinren and take Yu Bei Ping? Uh, maybe try to starve them and force them to sally forth or... Or fight them... You know what? I, oh, actually, if I could get them to sally forth, that would be huge. Ms. Garrison and... This army that's standing here is small. It's got some range capabilities. We've got a lot of cavalry. A lot of cavalry. And if I do bring this army to reinforce up over here in its damaged state, because we can rush out, 
we'll be able to keep the pressure on. A tough call. A tough call. A tough call. And you know what? That's going to be a call for which I turn to the council. You guys tell me. What do you think we should do? I think that what we should do is push in with Sunren and get the reinforcements here. They can replenish later. We'll push in. Try to starve them out. And if they sally forth, we'll destroy them. And if they don't sally forth, we'll cause damage, obviously, like attrition and stuff. But more importantly, we might draw that second army down before it's able to fully recruit. And we can crush both of them at once. I think that's where that second army went. And that should be really interesting. Alternatively, we just send Sunren and we attack right away. And I think that would be very possible as well. But she'll be isolated with uh, Ken Xiao Xiao a little behind. Oh, but it feels good though. It feels good though. And on that good feeling, folks, we're going to call it a session today. I hope you had a good time. As always, if you did, you know what to do. Drop a like and a comment down below. We're getting very close to finishing these guys off. I feel like I should do like a two-hour special or something of us finishing off Gung Sin Zen at some point. But that those are those get hard to watch. I think two hours gets really long. But uh, we really need to work on something with these 20-minute sieges happening. There's going to be... Uh, well, we're going to kick next session off with Yubei Ping, I think. We're going to uh, fight this battle over here, and we're also going to uh, push further into Penteng and Donghai. So next session is going to be an interesting one as well. Hope you guys are having a wonderful start to your July. As always, a massive thanks goes out to all of my channel members and patrons for supporting the channel on a monthly basis. You keep us alive and running smoothly. And a big old thanks goes out to each and every one of you for watching. Until next time, cheers.